Greetings, royal family, and welcome to yud Hey wav Hey Yahweh's Daily Word. Now, here is where you can listen to the scheduled scriptural readings for each day of our solar year. Our solar calendar is very different from all other calendars used today. To get your current solar calendar with the daily scriptural readings and the weekly Shabbat readings, visit us on our website at www.yahweh144000.com. Now, Royal Family, you can have Yahweh's Daily Word delivered to you each day just by remembering to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell. Today's scripture reading will be read by King El Yakim, and today's scripture reading is The Book of Jude. Jude, the servant of Yudhe Wafe, Beit Nun Sophit Yudhe Wafe, Christ, and brother of James, to them that are sanctified by Yahweh the Father, and preserved in Yudhe Wafe, Beit Nun Sophit Yudhe Wafe, Christ, and called. Mercy unto you, and peace and love be multiplied. Beloved, when I gave all diligence to write unto you of the common salvation, it was needful for me to write unto you, and exhort you, that ye should earnestly contend for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints. For there are certain men crept and unawares, who were before of old, ordained to this condemnation, ungodly men, turning the grace of our God Yahweh into lasciviousness, and denying the only Lord God Yahweh, and our Lord, Yudhe Wave, Beit Nun Sophit Yudhe Wave, Christ. I will therefore put you in remembrance, though ye once knew this, how that the Lord Yahweh having saved the people out of the land of Egypt, afterward destroyed them that believed not. And the angels which kept not their first estate, but left their own habitation, he hath reserved in everlasting chains, under darkness unto the judgment of the great day. Even as Sodom and Gomorrah, and the cities about them in like manner, giving themselves over to fornication, and going after strange flesh, are set forth for an example, suffering the vengeance of eternal fire. Likewise also, these filthy dreamers defile the flesh, despise dominion, and speak evil of dignities. Yet Michael the archangel, when contending with the devil, he disputed about the body of Moses, durst not bring against him a railing accusation, but said, The Lord Yahweh rebuke thee. Verse 10 But these speak evil of those things which they know not, but what they know naturally, as brute beasts, and those things they corrupt themselves. Woe unto them, for they have gone in the way of Cain, and ran greedily after the era of Balaam for reward and perished in the gainsaying of Kor. These are spots in your feasts of charity, when they feast with you, feeding themselves without fear. Clouds they are without water, carried about of winds, trees whose fruit withereth without fruit, twice dead, plucked up by the roots, raging waves of the sea, foaming out their own shame, Wandering stars, to whom is reserved the blackness of darkness forever. And Enoch also, the seventh from Adam, prophesies of these, saying, Behold, the Lord Yahweh cometh with ten thousands of his saints to execute judgment upon all and to convince all that are ungodly among them of all their ungodly deeds which they have ungodly committed and of all their hard speeches, which ungodly sinners have spoken against him. These are murmurers, complainers, 
walking after their own lust, and their own mouth speaketh great swelling words, having men's persons in admiration because of advantage. But, beloved, remember ye the words which were spoken before of the apostles of our Lord, Yudewafe, Beit Nun Sophit Yudewafe, Christ, how that they told you there should be markers in the last time, who should walk after their own ungodly lusts. These be they who separate themselves, sensual, having not the spirit. Verse 20. But ye, beloved, building up yourselves on your most holy faith, praying in the Holy Ghost, keep yourselves in the love of Yahweh, looking for the mercy of our Lord, Yudewafe, Beit Nun Sophit, Yudewafe, Christ, unto eternal life. And of some have compassion, making a difference, and others save with fear, pulling them out of the fire, hating even the garments spotted by the flesh. Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling, and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory, with exceeding joy, to the only wise God Yahweh, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever. Amen. Praise Yahweh. Praise Yahweh ben Yahweh. Praise Yudhe Wafe. Praise Yudhe Wafe. Beit Nun Sophie Yudhe Wafe. Royal family, have a glorious day in Yudhe Wafe. Shalom, royal family.